hey guys welcome to another video and in this video we are actually going to make a low health effect which includes a, a visual of course low health effect with um, post-processing and also uh, with audio so your audio sounds a little bit different um, when you have low health so yeah let's get right into it uh, I have set up a simple scene uh, which is actually actually from my last video so I just have a player a plane so you can walk and a simple canvas with two sliders actually and I don't have a health system in this game so we are just going to use the uh, hunger bar system so let's just say the hunger bar is the health for this video uh, so what we're going to do is we will check if our health or in this case hunger or for you it's health if your health is under a specific uh, number so under 20 or something and if this happens we will activate our uh, low health effects and change the audio a bit so yeah um the first uh, of course uh, this project uses the post processing from the unital universal render pipeline which means you have to install this first but yeah um yeah i just search for an easy tutorial on how to um install the universal render pipeline and then we can do it so if you have the universal universal render pipeline set up we can just right click here and create a global volume we're just gonna get in game for this and we just click on new profile here and yeah and what we're now going to do is we go to our camera and here under rendering we have to click on post processing um, and you need to do this with all of your cameras so yeah and then back in the global volume we can actually add a override and post processing and for low health we are actually uh, maybe going to do color adjustments and I don't know why it's loading uh, yeah good and then we can actually put the saturation maybe to there but we'll do this um, with scripts so we don't need to do it here we just do it uh, with scripts and then we will add another override which will be uh, where is it mm, vignette so this one too yeah we can just check this um yeah those will be the uh, two effects post-processing low health effects that we are going to do and yeah so of course the next thing that we're going to do is we go in our health script uh, for me it's of course the hunger bar but for you it will be health and the first things that we're going to do is actually here on the top we are going to uh, type in unity using unity engine um, dot rendering here and oh yeah of course I forgot this and the next thing is we're going to use unity engine unity engine dot I think it was uh, no 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 it was rendering uh, dot universal so we need those two things to it to work and um, now what we're going to do is we'll create a public of volume and we can just call it volume or low health vol volume good um, so so the next thing that we're going to do here is actually make a, a private color adjustments um, here color adjustments and we can just call it maybe color yeah uh, and we'll make a private um, vignette here and we can also call it yeah this should be good um good um so the next thing is in start we are going to make a volume no low health volume low health volume uh, dot get out 
now dot profile yeah the profile then we're gonna make no uh, dot try get um then here we can do out and then color adjustments yeah right um and then of course don't forget this then we can just copy this and paste it here and make the same thing for our vignette good um save it real quick uh, the next thing that we are going to do is in the update actually or yeah because here you can see our if statement so in the update we are going to make another if statement and we'll check if your health for me it's of course hunger um, is smaller or equal to let's say 20 and if this is the case then we want um, our um, I th yeah our color adjustments a dot value actually um, it should no dot saturation dot value we want this to be equal to uh, let's say minus 50 good um, and of course we also want our vignette dot uh, value no dot um, our vignette dot um, I think it was intensity yes uh, intensity dot value uh, to be let's say um, I know 0 0.7 or yeah 7 um, of course oh yeah 0.7 F don't forget that um, and this should be actually good now um, let's just try it out uh, uh, actually we need maybe we can yeah let's just try it out um, yeah so let's go um, we need of course need to attach the script um, but the script should be attached I think the hunger was uh, yeah here so our low health volume needs to be our global volume here and it will automatically do this so if we now hit play then if our um, if this is under 20 we should get the effects here you go uh, here you can actually see the effects we need to uh, maybe the uh, vignette is a bit too much but here you can see the effects so uh, the vignette is a bit too much maybe we can put it to point I don't know point three yeah yeah what you can also of course do is copy this thing no here copy this and put it here and if it's maybe under 10 we're gonna make it even more so maybe um, this and this so yeah um of course um if this doesn't happen so we're gonna put else if our hunger is bigger than um 20 and we're gonna put it to normal so we can just copy that and this needs to be then to zero and this also needs to be zero so now it should work let's just try it out here um, and if this ball reaches 20 we should get the first one yeah this is the first one and when it reaches 10 we should actually get uh, an even worse one but it, uh, I think it didn't work for me that good um yeah I don't know why it didn't work for me that good but it should work actually yeah it's I'm pretty sure it works for my other game it did work um yeah and the next thing that we're going to do is um, we're gonna ma we're gonna uh, make the audio a bit different. So uh, what we need to do is here uh, we need 
where's our on the object that has the audio listener we need to make a um audio uh, i think was low pass filter oh no it was uh where is it yeah it was a low pass filter um here because yeah now you so yeah on the audio low pass filter you can do whatever value you want i'm just gonna make it 100 or maybe a bit more i don't know maybe uh, yeah uh this should be good um yeah you can do whatever value you want and now we're going to go back to our script and what we're going to do is add here we're gonna add a public um audio low pass filter um here it is and we can just call it low pass filter good um and now in here we can set the uh, low pass filter at dot enabled um we can do it to true the same thing is of course here and here we want it to be false good so if we now save this and go here you need to uh, go to your, of course your player and go to your script and here you should see this one just drag that one in and it automatically gets the component and now if we hit play here our audio sounds normal and once we actually reach uh, under 20 it sounds different or we can even make it a bit more so you can hear it a bit more so if we put that here and you should be able to hear it even more so this is normal and this is with the filter so yeah um what you can also do is make a image with like some blood effects many games do that and yeah i'm gonna show you it too here and for this we actually of course need the image so i'm just gonna quickly get the image and then I'm right back so I just imported the image to unity and the first thing that we of course want to do is set it to a sprite and hit apply, apply here and yes um, then in our canvas you should have a canvas here we go 2d mode and actually on our canvas we will right click and create a UI image and this image we can click here and we can actually click I think alt on windows um, yes here alt and do this and then we are going to put this image in the sprite slot here it's not the best low health effect but I made it in like one minute so it's good for the tutorial um, yeah but we need to disable it actually because now we go in our health bar script and we'll make a new public game object and we just call it uh, low health image good um, and then here we are if the hunger is under 20 we are going to uh, set the low health image uh, dot uh, set active and we're going to set it to true then you can just copy this and set it true here too and here you want to set it to false good so now we are of course going to go to the script here and this image that we just disabled needs to be inside of here we can also rename this to low health image good um, now if we hit play we should actually be able to see the image once we have reached 
this perfect. So we have the image. You can of course do it on custom values. It has not, it doesn't have to be like twenty. You can of course also add uh, more images, like one for maybe if the health is ten, one for twenty, one for fifteen. You can actually uh, add multi multiply images. Um, so yeah. But that was actually it for this basic uh, low health effect. You can of course expand on it and maybe add a bit more interesting elements but yeah that's like the standard one and yeah that was actually it for this video and i hope you liked it if you did you can of course like the video subscribe for more tutorials and i'll see you in the next tutorial bye